Hey there. Here's a pretty unusual and innovative Swiss Army knife. This is a Wanger 19th hole cigar cutter. It's a retired model, as I guess all Wangers are now, uh, but it's model number 16887. And it's an 85 millimeter knife. It's like the Golf Pro, but instead of having the little combo tool, you know, that has the screwdriver, cap lifter, can opener, it has a cigar cutter. And so if you are a golfer who likes to smoke cigars, this is your Swiss Army knife. Uh, this actually is not my knife. I'm uh, helping a fellow collector and a pen pal who lives outside of the U.S. Uh, get this knife so he can give it as a gift to a friend and a fellow golfer. So I think this will make a very nice gift. So here's the cigar cutter. If you've not seen one of these before, um, Wanger made a really effective cigar cutter. It's large so it can uh, take off the entire cap of the cigar without just punching a little hole in it or cutting a groove. It, it, it can take off the entire cap. Uh, sharpen from both sides and um, sadly I do not have a cigar today to show you how it works or to smoke. <laughs> I like a good cigar. Uh, I wish I had one to pop out here and show you how this works. I've never tried one myself but I can just tell it's very effective looking. Um, you cannot, well you can get this tool still on a Victorinox, on a, one of their Evolution knives. Uh, it's called the Cigar 79. It's not a very sexy name, but it's like the Evo 14, but it's got the cigar cutter. And uh, so you can still get that tool in one Victorinox knife. But in addition to that great cigar cutter, this being the 19th hole cigar cutter, this knife has a lot of specialized golf tools. And the first one we'll look at is the cleat tool. So the idea here is you could slip this over the base of your golf cleat and tighten it or loosen it. And then here we have a divot repair tool. Now admittedly, I am not a golfer and I'm a little perplexed by this. I don't know how this helps you repair a divot, but I think the idea is you stab the, the piece of uh, turf and you can put it back with your shoe maybe and not get your hands dirty. That's probably the idea or not get your gloves dirty. And then the other specialized golf tool on this model is here on the back. Instead of a corkscrew or Phillips driver, we have a, a club face cleaner. And the idea here is that uh, on the, you know, this goes in, uh, goes in the grooves of the face of your woods or your irons to clean them out. Pretty cool. And then a couple standard tools that you find on uh, all these 85 millimeter wingers, or most of them anyway. Here's a uh, nail file nail cleaner, and then the main blade. And the main blade on this one is particularly nice. I think the buyer will be happy with that. So here on the front you see there's a couple of crossed golf clubs. Um, those are uh, not inlaid. There are uh, silk screened on there. And you could get this, I think it normally came in red, but obviously you could get it in green. And it also came in black and blue. There was also like a executive version that was stainless, quite rare. So you have a stainless 19th hole cigar cutter. So that's just a really cool knife. Uh, Wanger uh, did a really good job of putting specialized tools on their different knives to uh, appeal to different hobbyists and sportsmen. I mean, some of them that come to mind, uh, I know they had one for bicyclists. They had one with a, a choke uh, tube tool for shotgunners. They had one for snowboarders, one for skiers, of course, fishermen, uh, golfers. They even had one for rollerbladers, and they've got some for sailors as well. And I'm sure there, I could go on. Um, I'm sure I'm missing several there. But they had a lot of uh, cool ideas there for specialized tools. So this is a great knife. I'm glad I had a chance to take a look at it. And uh, thank you to the buyer for letting me make a video of it. And I'm sure your friend will really, really appreciate this. This will make a fantastic gift. Uh, but the 19th hole cigar cutter without a cap lifter or a uh, corkscrew? Hmm. Yeah, I guess so. I guess you can always get your waitress to uh, open your beer or uncork your wine bottle. But you know you're not letting her touch your David off or your Monte Cristo. Thanks for watching and have fun collecting.